Hey everyone, it's Tara Styles. Hope you're having an amazing day so far, wherever you are. I am at the fabulous W Maldives here. As you can see, this is not a screensaver. This is actually real. This is my room at the property and I can literally jump off of my balcony and there's steps down if I want to be a little bit more careful, but I've jumped several times in the morning and I can swim right from my room into the ocean and swim around and have a great time with the fish and get my swim on. So I just wanted to check in with you all and say hi. I'm here leading a fantastic retreat with a group of wonderful people from around the world. We're doing sunrise yoga every day. It's a glorious way to really wake up and enjoy being connected to yourself and inspired and energized for the day. We finish each day with a sunset yoga class really to wind down and to feel good and calm and easy in our bodies and easy in our minds and all of that great stuff. And then all day long we play. We went swimming with the whale shark yesterday. Tonight we're going UV snorkeling and it's been a really great time. So come check out the W Maldives if you ever get here. It's a fantastic place to be. It's definitely a once in a lifetime experience. It's pretty far from most places in the world, but if you if you put it on your list, I, I highly recommend to put this place on your list because it's amazing. And if you're not currently on retreat, it's okay. You can be on retreat in your mind. I know when I go back to New York, there'll be a million things to do. There's always a million things to do. But the main thing that I've really learned this year and that I'm carrying on with me to 2015 is to really being easy and calm in my mind, keeping that regular practice of being soft in my body and soft in my mind so I can focus and really be clear with what I want to accomplish in my life instead of being just busy all of the time because the truth of it is we are all busy all of the time so that's sort of like done and over with it's a given you know it's just like we're all spiritual beings because we all have a spirit so um so instead of talking about spirituality it's much more important to practice being a kind gentle human being as the dalai lama says and all these highly spiritual people so instead of just being busy all the time we can accept the fact that everybody's busy everybody has a million things to do and that's okay. That's just how life is. And it's because we want to accomplish things or we want to achieve things or, or help people in our lives. And, and really the goal for myself, and, and I want to share this with you, and hopefully, you know, maybe you can get connected here too and, and feel inspired and share with me what your goals are for 2015. I'd love to hear. But my main goal is to really stay focused, stay easy in my body, easy in my mind, so I can really accomplish hard, challenging things on my busy list in a soft, easygoing way and really be clear and focused with what those those main things are. So with all that said, so much good stuff coming your way in 2015. I've got big plans for you guys to to bring Strala Yoga to you guys wherever you are around the world with um, you know the videos and everywhere and classes and studios and I don't want to give it all the way because it's too exciting. But um YouTube has really been a great place and I sort of forgot about it for a while. You know, it's something I started back in early 2007, put up videos, made friends, really started to define what Strala Yoga was and still I go around all around the world and connect with people that practice the videos and feel better because they're practicing yoga in an easygoing way every day. They're eating the healthy recipes and really making this lifestyle about feeling good and the perspective of having fun and being easy on yourself. Yourself and and having a good time and having this idea that caring for yourself is the most important thing so I really want to leave you guys today with the idea that the food is not the most important thing the yoga is not the most important thing the meditation is not the most important thing the exercise is not the most important thing the most important thing is you and how you connect to yourself how you feel is the most important thing so I encourage you today to take care of yourself, to follow how you feel, to move how it feels great to move in your body, to linger where it feels nice to linger in your body and your life, and to really cultivate how that feels in yourself, to cultivate that strength and that awareness and that mobility and that range of motion, not just physically, but in our lives as well. So how we practice on the mat is how we are in our lives. So I encourage you to practice being easy and kind to yourself so that can really spread out magically into your life and you can do amazing things out in the world, which, um, which is great. <laughs> so my job, if I have a job at all, and something that I know that I really want to share and, and leave a mark on this world is helping you get back to connected to yourself. So if I can connect you back inward to yourself, then, then I'm happy. 
So that's it. So, so go out and get connected inside. When you're practicing yoga, don't worry about the pose. Don't worry about anything. Come back to yourself. Come back to how you feel. Come back to paying attention. That's all this whole work is about. Everything that I've ever done in my life in this category, in this space, is all about ease, all about you coming back to yourself. So I don't care about the yoga pose. I don't care about meditation. I don't care if you're eating kale for three meals a day. I care about you, and I care about you feeling good, and I care about you being connected to how you feel. Because I know what, if you are connected to how you feel, everything else is going to work out. You're going to not just achieve your goals, but you're going to go way past all those goals into a brand new universe of awesomeness that is you. So I'm going to stop this video blog right now, jump in the ocean, have a great time, and go lead some sunset yoga, and I will see you very soon. If you're not connected to everything, get connected. Send out some newsletters with everywhere that I'm at. TaraStyles.com, you can sign up for that. Check the events page. I travel quite a bit, so I'm coming to see you all of the time. So make sure um, if you want to come see me and do a class or a talk or see what's going on and do a lot of meetups as well, get connected and most importantly, get connected to you because you are important. You are the most important. Take care of yourself. I love you guys and I'll see you soon.